Good morning, good morning, good morning. You know who it is, the cat in the hat, your resident fly guy, your chief architect, Michael Andrew of StarArchitects.com, and it's Monochromatic Monday. Yo, it is the beginning of the week. This is your opportunity to make your best, your first day, your best day, and set the tone for the rest of the week. Um, today, we are actually starting off our month with a new conversation about shirts. Yes, that is right. We talked about centering the center of your attention um, when it came to your pants. Now we're gonna be talking about centering you and your framework, how you are going to frame that wonderful face that is going to carry so much expression uh, beyond your style. So today we're gonna be having a conversation quickly about colors. And here are the three colors that you should have in your wardrobe. Now disclaimer, these are not going to be specific colors that you are going to need in your wardrobe. The reason being is because I believe that every man has to find out what works for him. Now, we're more than happy to help you with that at stylearchitects.com, but I wanted to give you a baseline for certain things that you can start considering. And the three, the, the three that you should be looking for are number one, your base colors. So every man should have a base color that they can go to. The second is going to be your transitional color. So something that's going to help you transition from day to night from uh, casual to sporty or from dress to casual. And lastly, something that is going to pop. Now I'm gonna give you three quick examples for, that are gonna relate to me because I'm the best example that I can give you. The first one for me is a basic color. Instead of me doing white, I do off-white, slightly off-white uh, for my color story. My color story tends to be, uh, or is autumn. So because of that, I need to have something that is going to be slightly off-white. Icy or white colors work for me, but not as well as that off-white color. When it comes to my transitional colors, uh, a transitional color that really works for me is more of a rose. Um, pinks do work for me as well, but a, a true pink or a rose color is going to be a great transition for me handling handling business to me handling something that's going to be casual or business casual after that or even me going to something that's a little bit more sporty and I can you know take off my jacket I can untuck my shirt or keep my shirt tucked in for the casual space and then untuck it if it's something that is going to be much more sporty and just kind of having fun and hanging out and then lastly for my color that pops my color that pops is purple See, I'm popping right now. You see, we pop my collar. <laughs> and then also, uh, like minty greens, because those are, are two complementary colors for me, and they tend to be lighter on the color scale um, towards the tints, and so they make my skin pop. So that's the ultimate goal for you when you are um, in this, this space, is to always show up in a powerful light and expressing the type of energy that you want to attract. That's the ultimate thing when it comes to your shirt. You're framing how other people are literally going to see you. Don't forget that that shirt is the closest thing to that beautiful mug you got right there. So try that on, see how it fits you. Um, please leave me some comments in the comment box with this question of the day. What are your favorite colors and what colors do you feel like look best on you? I would love to hear your thoughts. Um, please make sure that you are checking out all the other videos. I'm telling you, there's always going to be some good insight there and at least something for you to try on to see how it fits you. And uh, please make sure that you give this a thumbs up if you were enjoying, if you're, if you are enjoying the conversation. I'm gonna get my words together this Monday. Don't, you know, don't hate. Uh, and secondly, please make sure that you share this with your friends if you found this information informative or thought provoking. And lastly, please make sure that you subscribe if you're feeling the vibe. I'm going to be here every Monday through Friday uh, by noon. I'm sorry, by 12.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So I'll be more than happy to drop you with this game. But before I go, if you haven't been here. Uh, then let me tell you, and if you have, then you know what it is. Dress is nothing more than the expression of a man's state of mind, so you should always dress to express. I will see you tomorrow. Peace.